episode of HTTV Live. I am Jack Boomsma. I'm Elliot Harford. And uh, this is our second broadcast of the new year, so that's cool. Mm -hmm. um, so first off, we're going to send it over to Briar with the Kids in the Elementary. You, Briar. Hello, I'm Briar Close for HTTV Live. I'm here with... Chandler. Hi, Chandler. So what grade are you in? First grade. First grade. Um, how was your Christmas break then? Good. Good. Did you get all your presents on your Christmas list? Yeah. Yeah? What was your favorite present? My bow and arrow. Your bow and arrow. That sounds cool. Thank you. Hello, and now I'm here with... Riel. So, Riel, what grade are you in? Second. Second grade. Um, what did you guys do over Christmas break? We went to my dad's side uh, at my grandma's house. Okay. Did you get everything on your Christmas list? Mm-hmm. Yeah. What is your most favorite present that you got? My Lego set. Your Lego set? That sounds awesome. Thank you. And now I'm here with... Brady. Brady. Uh, what grade are you in then? Third. Third grade. What did you guys, what did you do over Christmas break? Mm, I went to Minnesota. Minnesota? Sound cold. Uh, did you get all your Christmas list? Mm, no. No? Of all the presents that you got, what was your favorite? Mm, the Nintendo Switch. Nintendo Switch, that sounds awesome. And now back to the desk. Thank you, Dyer, for the, those lovely interviews. And now we'll send it to Jacob. What's the weather? See you, Jacob. Hey, it's the weather, man. For your seven day forecast in Hitchcock this week, for Friday we have a high of 31, low of 5. Uh, Thursday or Saturday is a high of 16, low of 12. Uh, Sunday will be a high of 38, low of 22. Monday is a high of 34, low of 19. And Tuesday is a high of 31, low of 0. Wednesday is a high of 18, low of 5. And Thursday is a high of 19, low of 6. For your seven day forecast in two air this week, uh, for Friday is a high of 31, low of 5. Saturday is a high of 16, low of 12. Uh, for Sunday is a high of 38, low of 22. Monday, high of 34, low of 19. Tuesday is a high of 31, low of 0. Wednesday is a high of 18, low of 5. And Thursday is a high of 19, low of 6. There's also a chance of snow Friday and Saturday. Back to you. Thank you for that weather report, Jacob, and uh, I think we're supposed to get some snow tomorrow. Yeah, it's supposed to be chilly. I heard it's supposed to be a lot of snow too, like six four inches. Four to six inches. It'll be good for the moisture, but not good for the roads. Yeah. Oh, and also a little friendly reminder with that. Um, if the game's on Saturday, the boys' first round of 281 conference will also get canceled. Monday will be the makeup day for that, and more than likely the boys' games will all be in JVC that day. Yeah. And so now we will send it to Zach with sports. Here uh, with the sports update, uh, this past week the girls played Northwestern in Tulare. Uh, that was a win, 39-31. to 31. Uh, Then they, this last Tuesday, uh, so two days ago, uh, they played Warner in Tulare again, and they lost 43-50, to 50, so that was a close one there. Um, for the boys, uh, last Thursday, or last Friday, my bad, they played Falkton in Falkton, and uh, the score of that was 31-69, so a tough one there. So, and then this last Tuesday, they played Warner in our home, home, our home gym in Tulare, and won 54-49, and that is the first time he beat Warner in 11 years. So that's pretty exciting. So, uh, upcoming uh, games, the 281 is starting this weekend. Uh, this Friday, the girls will play James Valley Christian in Wolsey um, at 3.30, or 6, 6.30, it should be 6.30. Um, and then for the boys on Saturday, they will go to Wolsey as well and play Sanborn Central Woonsocket at 1 o'clock. So there you go. Now I'm here with Coach Smith. Uh, Coach Smith, uh, you've had a couple games this past couple weeks. Uh, you want to talk about a few of them? 
Yeah, we had two home games or um, past two games. And first of all, I want to thank our crowd. We had an awesome crowd last Thursday night. Um, all of you guys did a great job cheering for us, and we got the victory against Northwestern. And then last night, um, we played a tough game against Warner. It was a very good team, but came on um, came up short in the end. But lots of takeaways from both of those games, um, and we just want to keep working and getting better moving forward. Okay. Uh, this week coming up is the 281. Uh, any focuses going into that? Um, we go into the 21 tournament as a fifth seed. We play James Valley on Monday night. Oh, excuse me, on Friday night. All my days are all mixed up. But, um, you know, we just really want to get a win that first round and see how far we can go. You know, it's a big rival game to start off our tournament. We're super excited. The 21 tournament is always a fun time um, of the year, and we're just really looking forward to getting out there and playing again. And uh, I hear rumor has it we'll have a pretty good cheering section for all those games for you. So Really? Yeah. We're looking forward to that. And I hope the girls, you know, they were do, will um, return the favor. Um, shout out to our guys on an amazing win last night. And we look forward to cheering for you guys as well. So. Well, thank you. Good luck, Coach. All right. Thank you. Thank you, Zach, for the lovely uh, sports update. You know? And also, a little fun fact if Zach failed to mention it. Uh, <laughs> this is the first time that the Hitchcock Tuller Patriots have beat the Warner Monarchs in 11 years. That's not nice. But yeah, this is awesome. Great news, 11 years. Like, that's some real broken streak, kind of doing really groundbreaking stuff right yeah. now. Yeah, you know I mean, we, like, doing a pretty good year for the boys. I mean, Girls, girls are doing pretty good too. Football. football, we broke a streak of not making it to second round playoffs for like 12 years. Something like that. And then like this but big I, game. Anyway, uh, now we will send it to Briar once again with the next new student. <laughs> Hi, I'm Briar Close for HGTV Live. I'm here with Nick Tollison. Who is in ninth grade, I believe? Yes. So, Nick, um, how are you liking school so far? It's pretty good. Pretty good. Have you learned anything new so far? Not really. Not really? You play any sports? Football. Football? Thank you, Briar, for that new student interview. I think that should be the last one of the year. Hope not hopefully, but maybe. <laughs> yeah, I think so. But uh, I have upcoming events. So on January 14th, there is teacher in-service. And also on January 14th, that is the start of the 21 conference, starting with the girls' games at 3.30. And then... Uh, the game, a girls game play tomorrow in Wolsey at 6.30. Then January 15th, the game start at 1 o'clock. And uh, the boys play San Martin Central Woonsocket at 1 o'clock in Wolsey. And also on January 18th, is 21 championship round game starts at 3.30 in Wolsey. Um, and the 21 Constellation Championship is at 3.30 p.m. in JVC. And then January 20th, 281 final round is at Huron and that starts at 9 o'clock. So, yeah. Yeah, yeah. Uh, I got birthdays. Uh, so, I would like to wish happy, happy birthdays to Adeline Ian, Glendon with uh, Jacob Mickledge <laughs> and uh, Brooklyn Frankenstein. So, happy birthday, guys. <laughs> As always, folks, thank you for tuning in to another episode of HDTV Live. I am Ron Burgundy. And I am Brian Fabs Hanna. Stay classy, Hitchcock Tuller.